Hello, everyone. It's Lindy. Hello, everyone. This is Sean. We are back with you again to show you Sean's small ironing press boards. This one is mine. It's a 12 by 12. I didn't want one as large because I don't do those projects. If I do, I'll just use his. <laughs> um, so mine is a 12 by 12. Again, he's um, covered it with fabric that I chose because I'm different. I had to have the quilting things. And then I have the felt on the back. I will try to match the felt color to your board as best as I can. Um, again, this one is made like the other one. Um, it's made out of wood, um, batting and some of the ironing fabric, as well as your top um, piece here. These um, are going to be $25, and I'm going to show you a round number four fabrics that are going to be A, B, C, D. If you're interested, please email me. My email is listed below, or you can send me a Facebook message. It is first come first serve. And let me get in and I will show you some fabric choices if you are interested in an ironing board. Round number five because we've already done our large if you haven't seen it go check that out round, um, round five a is going to be this white fabric with pink florals and greens i have one of these available that is our a B is another pink, and we got some greens and yellows and orange. I like this one, and this one um, is kind of like a soft velvety feel to it, kind of like a corduroy type feel. Um, that is our B. We have one of those available. C is for our rooster friends. We have this cream colored fabric with different kinds of roosters and I have one of these available. Let's just see it up close again with the different colors. That is our C. D, I also have one, and it is green and white, and let's see, that's a cream color there, and we have the daisies, and I have one of those. I'm going to lay this down and give you a few moments to view those. Round six. I'm going to scoot these down just a bit. All right. I have two of A this round. This is for my bee lovers. We have honeycombs with bees on there. We've got a, um, a yellow. We have an orange. And then we have like a color, um, orange yellow color blended together there. It is a cream colored fabric and I have two available. B, I have a black and gray with, with a golden yellow. It's a golden yellow um, floral there as well. It's on a white background. That is our B, and I have one of those available. C is this wild fabric, kind of like myself here. 
Is this something I would choose? <laughs> and we got so many colors in there. I have one of those. That is a C. D is for the coffee lovers. We have this fabric here. That is our D and I have one available. If you watch the other video and you like any of the fabrics in there and you want that on a small board, message us because we can make that happen as well if you're interested. All right, this is round six. And we're going to have a round seven. And this one is appropriate for these boards. This is a Sewing Notions fabric. So you have all the buttons, scissors, threads, needles, pins. And it's like a a white with pink polka dots um, in the background. There you go. I have one of these available. That's our A. B is for our purple girls. We have some a light purple fabric with dark purple leaves and stems and white flowers. Like daisies. Yeah, daisies. That is our B, and of course we have one of those. Now I have a orangey coral color, and again it has those daisies on there. This time they're big and small and medium. We have one of those. And D is, it looks like a vintage fabric. So we have reds and blues and greens on a white fabric. And it's really soft. It feels like a, maybe like a flannel. I don't know. It's really soft though. And I have one of those. That is round seven. And on to round eight. This is for our country people. We've got this maroon and blues and browns. And it looks like it's this quilt. We have one of those. Then we have this fabric here that looks like it could be used for a teacher or a classroom or if you decorate with apples. It's like a cream colored with reds and a navy blue. C is for our rooster lovers, and I love this fabric. I could probably do this in a large, too. So it's blacks and grays, and we got some yellow, 
red and greens on a cream colored fabric. It's beautiful. Oh, and we got some raspberries going on. So I do have enough if you see this and you want it on a large too, that would be 35. And I have more of the sewing notions on a blue fabric. It's a fun fabric. All right. That is our D that round. Right. Round nine A is a green and a purple. It's got tea time on there, it looks like. R A B is a white fabric with blues and greens and a cream color stripe. have one of those. That's our B. C is a gray and white checkered in case you want something more neutral. I have enough to do two of those I believe. D this round is this blue and then it's cream colored with dark blue and I have one of those. And that is our D. Round 10, I'm only going to show you an A and a B. So I'm going to scoot them over here. Here is our A. It is a cream colored fabric with greens, blues, and yellows. It is stunning. I have one of those. Is that like vintage? vintage you know? This? Yeah. Probably. It looks vintage, but all right. B, I have a quilted piece with the fall colors. We have some greens and blacks, a burgundy. We got some pumpkins, some leaves. Um, so this is a fall fabric, and this is an off-white. And I have one of those available. That is round 10, A and B. We're going to have a round 11, but I wanted to keep them together. All right, that's A and B of round 10. All right, last round for the small ironing boards. I have... Can you make sure those are all out, please? This is Kathy Hoden. This is her um, leather lace and amazing grace. This is the blue and white checkered. 
I have one available. This is the pink and white checkered, and I have one available. The red and white checkered, one available. And then I have the blue roses. Again, this is Kathy Holden Round. This is, they're all from the Leather Lace and Amazing Grace line. And I have just the one of each available. <coughs> if you're interested, please send us that email and we will respond and let you know that we got it. We'll start processing so we can get you billed and shipped out as soon as we can. Thank you guys for watching. We love you a long time. And thank you for all of your support. Yes, thank you for coming. Bye.